hello. Uh, hello. Today is December 18th, 2011, and I'm still sick. Um, hey, look what I got. I, I got these last night. I don't know where I got them. They're kind of cool, huh? I mean, go think. I didn't even think I'd even have them things, right? No, it was actually, uh, I went out last night, first time, um, it was kind of neat, but, uh, no, today's, uh, December 18th, 2011, um, this be video number 04, G. just to tie up last month, that's why next month I can just make one or two videos, and this video is sort of kind of important that, you know, saying goodbye to paranoia, delusion, I, I also uh, saw my therapist yesterday, my once a month visit, and, oh God bless her, she's just, she's nice, um, but she brought up something that I always seem to do, I guess I always seem to bring the negative, I always, and maybe not so much the negative, I always seem to worry, and I, I think it's being transgendered, I think a lot of us um, can relate, not all of us, some of us can relate, that have hidden it a while, we, we always have this paranoia delusion that, you know, what if scenario, what if this, what if that, what if, you know, my gosh, what if this, what if that, and, you know, what happens if that happens to that, and if that happens to this, and what, you, you just drive yourself crazy. Um, so, I'm making this video to sort of say goodbye to paranoia and delusion. Um, I'll still have it, but I need to work on it a little bit. That's going to be my assignment um, for 2012, along with getting out and saying hello to everybody. Um, I had a blast last night. It was um, uh, kind of neat. I didn't wear no makeup or nothing. Um, I didn't, because I went to the therapist. And then I just stayed in Dallas instead of coming all the way back down south and then all the way back up and get dressed and change. I just pretty much wore what I wore tonight. Well, I wore a different shirt, but pretty much the same thing. I need to go shower. I got to work tonight. I got to get rid of those. Gosh darn it. And I wanted to work with those. <laughs> um. A special thanks to everybody's uh, private emails and uh, one individual's phone calls. She should remain nameless. Uh, I think I left that message on my phone just for the fun of it. Anyway, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, paranoid delusion. I mean, it's just worrying too much. Worrying about this, worrying about that. And, you know, we all have to worry about something. Um, it's just when we over worry. I don't know how a word that is. It's just overanalyzing our worries, maybe, um, would be a better way of putting it. It just, it's not a healthy scenario. And uh, so my therapist wants me to work on that, um, which is good I, because I overanalyze a lot of things. And it's just the way. I'm, well, take the transition, take the hormones. Before I started hormones, before I started taking a little blue pill, I analyzed the crap out of those. I mean, because I had bought, purchased over the internet, you know, prescriptions. I didn't take them, but, you know, there goes a lot of research. And so I was over analyzing, analyzing. And, um, you know, just, you know, thinking of timelines and all this and for four months. I think um, I've worried, you know, I, I had one worry. That's how it all came about was because of that blood panel test. She just says, I worry, worry too much. And, and I told her, I said, well, things are going so good right now that, you know, I'm just waiting for things to explode. I mean, just things are just so happy and jolly. I couldn't, it, it couldn't be better. I mean, I'm on hormones. I got my fiance, um, you know. I got a job. Um, I'm not out on my job, but I got a job. I, you know, got my real hair. I mean, um, and it's a mess. And um, I got 
my little booblets, they're... See, this don't even do it. I can't even do that with this sweatshirt. I can't even do that. But, uh... They're a bee already. You see, you imagine, uh, four months. It hasn't even been four months. The online calculator said a C. They're not a C. Because I think that being transgender, because there's still a lot of background work that's got to be done. I mean, because you got the center and then you got the background, and the background needs working. So, that being said, I, they're a good B, though. They're a good solid B. Um, so, yeah. Um, I just need to stop over, and I just said that, didn't I? So 2012 is coming out. You know, the holidays are almost over. Um, I just, I don't know. What What are your thoughts? Uh, this is a short, short video. I, you know, I over analyze. I mean, analyzing things, worrying about things. I mean, there's certain things you need to worry about. I mean, do you, you know, get a flat tire? Well, okay, let's use that. If you sit there, even if you're, you just worry about a flat tire over and over and over, and, you know, down in the ghetto in projects or something. I don't know. I, that might be a bad example. I have some good friends that live in the projects. Um, I used to have. Um, but there's certain areas you always worry about. You worry about stubbing your toe uh, on your bed. You, my gosh, I, you know, I gotta watch that corner. I'm gonna keep stubbing my toe. I'm gonna keep, you know, you just keep on worrying about it, worrying about it. Pretty soon you're gonna make it happen because you're over worrying about stubbing your toe so many darn times that, you know, gosh darn it, subconsciously you do it or something, right? You know, I, so I can't worry. And I think that's what I've been worried about is losing my job a lot. You know, what if this, what if that? I don't need to, you know, I still need to take steps and work on it. You know, work on a what if, but I, maybe just the one what if, and then, okay, here's my plan. Here's, here's what I get. I got to start turning things into a positive side. And that's another thing our therapist said I need to do. I need to start catching myself when I start speaking negative and rewording it, writing it down or something when I say something, I'm rewording it I, I'll have to work on that um, make everything positive uh, but there is going to be downfalls no matter what, there are downfalls in anybody, you know, cisgender transgender I, it don't matter I mean the Grinch even had happy days, I mean come on Merry Christmas um, everybody by the way you got my Christmas bonus too, that was kind of neat um, hopefully, uh, everybody's, and everybody's family has a good Christmas. I'm just going to spend it with my fiance. Um, I'll have a good Christmas. I lost, I lost my mom last year. I lost my dad last summer, so. It's all good. Um, I mean, it's not all good. It's just, I mean, it's all good now. I just. Anywho, I'm going to have to start this video over. I don't know if I want that in this video. I'll leave it in there. What the heck? It, you know, it's nothing that really affected my transition anyway. Um, they never knew about it. They probably suspected, but they never knew about it. Um, they didn't know about my ears being pierced, and that was about it. Because I got them pierced last November, and... I saw that. You got your ears pierced. But anywho, yeah, I got those. I got to take it off before I go to work tonight. That might be offensive to some people at work and they might want to get rid of me or something. See, there I go wearing again. Look at that. Does that come with every shirt I got? Every shirt I buy has this like extra string or something. You know, if China or wherever they make these shirts, if they just stop adding this extra string they would save on so many costs I, I they, 
this shirt probably cost eight ninety seven instead of eight ninety eight. Anywho, yeah, don't try this on, kids. Okay. Woo! Ow! Don't try that on. All right, so now I got rid of it. I know I got a black spot on now too. I have to bleach that out. It probably wasn't my smartest decision. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Unedited, uncutted. You wonder why I unedit my videos and make them longer this way, but you never know what you can to get. So, anywho, yes. Saying goodbye to the paranoid delusions. Um, and working on getting rid of them. Being happy. I mean, you know, be true, be yourself. I, I, I do that a lot myself, but I always, I worry a lot too. Everybody does. They overanalyze. You got to, you know, with the job market and everything like that. Um, can't believe it's almost four months. Dang it! And my therapist liked my new eyebrows. My hair dye. She liked all that. I showed her about the uh, checks too. I got my checks in. Oh, and I got a. Uh, I had to because they were like uh, they had to get me a hard binder because I keep those letters this is a good idea so you guys do I mean it's a business card holder and I just put the red clips on it I got too many on here but I'll never open this really so but this is a good idea because I found when I was put my therapist letter in my purse, it was getting like thrashed. And something this long was actually, you know, not open it. Oops. See, I got the envelopes in here. Which is one from the county courthouse doing my DBA that I did in the previous video. Because, see, I got to keep a record of that now that it's filed. And the other copy of my therapist letter. And then I put them in this because it's got like a hard, you know, hard binder. I could put other stuff in it if I wanted, I guess. But I took the business card out thing. Whoa, what the heck? Woohoo! Light show. Um, so, that's cool. Did that. I know, I just wasted about a minute explaining that to you, didn't I? Paranoid delusion. Um, so, anywho. I'm going to go... This should be the last video of the month. My next video will be Christmas. Not to wish everybody a Merry Christmas. It will be my fourth month completed. I gotta remember, I don't celebrate until the 25th. Which means I only have five more months. So I'll let you in a little secret. My birthday is actually May 25th. So if you calculate nine months back from when I started hormones... Guess what my nine month anniversary is going to be? What usually happens in nine months? I know, I just overanalyzing everything. All right. I did that as part of a plan, actually. That was kind of cool. So, um, I'm fixing what my parents messed up, I guess. <laughs> um, see, there we go. So, yeah, if you got letters and stuff like that, get a binder or something that doesn't bend. So now I can go in the back of my purse and be all good. Anyway, until next time, be true. Be yourself. Peace.